All right, so after making our cat, then I've decided to create a text box here by simply going to insert, then I got a text box here. So I drew the text box, then put some text there. Then I formatted this text by right clicking format shape, then I removed no fill, then no line, then yeah, then make it bigger and change the color. So that is everything that I've done so far. Then I put some text here just to represent the cards we are dealing with. Right, again, I'm going to start with total casualty here. Before I start, I'm going to insert um, an icon here. So let's go to insert. Let's go to pictures. Over the cell. Pictures over the cell, this device. Okay, so I'm gonna make this smaller. I'm gonna put it right here. Make it, make it smaller and put it right here. Make it a bit bigger. Then I'm going to do analysis. Right now, I'm going to control A, then insert our pivot tables from table range, then click OK. Okay, so I'm going to call this analysis. The first thing I want to do here, I want to create, I want date, then I want number of casualties that we have, then I'm going to deselect cutter here. Mount is fine. Then I will take this here. I want to put it in separate columns. I want to remove this accident date. Again, I want to remove this ground daughter. I'm going to go to design, then daughter of do not show. With this done, I'm going to copy this. I'm going to paste it here. Then I'm going to make this, that's why I'm going to remove month field. Then I want my year to be, yeah, to be, is okay, that's why. Then I want the sum of the two. The sum on them here. Yeah. So I'm going to go back here, then I'm going to copy this text box, paste it, move it, clean this, go to our formula bar, I'm going to, I'm going to go to analysis, I'll pick this, okay, then I need to format this, I want this to be just a single, not decimal point. Okay, so this, I'm going to make this bigger. This is going to be lots of black. Then I want this to be 36. Okay. I'm going to make this status 4. Secondly, I'm going to do casualty for these guys. I'm going to go back to analysis. I will copy this. I'm going to paste it here. Yeah, I'm going to take Psyverte. Then I'm going to remove the ear. So this is good. That's why. So I'll copy this text box, I'll paste it here. Then I'll change this to analysis, then select this. I'll make this 
not to black. I'll make this 28. I'll do the same for the rest. Copy, paste, paste, I'll put one here. And this, since this is L5, I'm gonna make this will be five. And this will be six. Then I'll copy this formatting. I'll put it here and I'll put it here. Okay, so I'm gonna change the formatting here. I want some command here. And this is done. This seems big, okay. Now I want some donut chart here. So first off, I will need to take bring in this to create a donut chart. I want this. Then I need to find percentage of this. Okay, quickly, I need to activate something here. Yeah, let's go to design, then let's show our grand total. Show on the columns alone. Okay, so yeah, I need to find percentage of these. So, so I'm gonna do this, two columns, clean up the first one. Then select this one, downward, clean the second one as well. Then I'm going to use F4. So I'll do the same for the rest. Then make it a percentage. I'll put 100% here. Then the difference between these two, let's do equals this minus this. Okay. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is select this. Then let's go to insert, go to recommended chat, then go to this one. I'm going to remove this one, remove this one. This color, I want to change this color. I want something light gray. Then for this one, double click on that one. I want something, because it's small, I'm going to use this color. Click on the circle once and make the line disappear. Come to this and then make the donut size smaller. Yeah, this way. Come back to formatting, make this line disappear. Make no fill. Make it smaller. Cut this, then I'm gonna paste it here. Okay, so this is the same color with what we have there. Okay, so I'm gonna double click on this again. And for this color, I'm gonna make it this. Then make it bigger. Okay, so now I'm going to put some text inside this one. Let's copy this text. Then I'm gonna put it here. For this one, I'm gonna do, this is gonna be 2%. Then I'm 
I'm going to make this text smaller, put it in the middle. Then let's apply this formatting to the text. Let's make the text smaller again. I'm gonna make this 20. Yeah, then I'm gonna put this in the middle. So I wanted to, to repeat the same process for serious casualty and then the slight casualty as well. So I've done the same for serious, then I'm going to do the last one again for slight casualty, which is gonna be this one. So we've completed the first card here. Now, secondly, what we need to do is the number of casualty by month. So let's go back to our month. Let's select this. Then I want us to go to insert, go to recommended chart, find the column chart. This is perfect. Click OK. I'm going to hide all this. Right click, then hide all feed bottom on the chart. I'm going to delete this line. Select the line and delete. This, I'm going to make this display in thousands. I'm going to remove this, then I'm going to delete it. Then this should be at the top. I want this to show at the top. I'm going to activate our labels. Let it be outside. Then legend, let it be at the top. So I'm going to click on this, make it bigger. Okay, this is fine. Let's go to, to chat and um, I'm going to make this 55 or 45 okay so no line then I'm going to change this color to this then this I'm going to set no line again I want this color to be cortoise blue okay then this I want special formatting, come to category, custom. I have something typed in here, so type in the pants sign, then um, double quotation mark and put um, K in the middle. Okay, so then add, remember to add. So I'm gonna do this again, custom, K. I'm going to add and that is done okay so I have this I'm going to remove the fill no borderline I'm going to cut this then I'm going to put it here and this match perfectly so I'm going to leave it this way I'm going to make the mounts bold right again so here we're going to work on number of casualties.